Hey guys, we're back with TV and Buzzer. Yeah, I'm awesome. And we're here for Legend of the Korra Book 3, Episode 2. So we just finished off watching the first episode and that ending. I'm so fucking intrigued by that guy who just fucking escaped prison. He has some sick liners. So he's got some sick skills. And this guy, I'll give you some sick hair too. Yeah, bro. Yeah, that guy. <laughs> so he, he, he just, bro. Check marks for everything, man. I guess a badass. I'm so excited to see what he's gonna do. And he's gonna have the White Lotus and uh, Korra, who so. is struggling. Yeah, balancing between the two worlds, man, is yeah. Like, it was it was it was never gonna be as smooth as I think. I think, I think I kind of remember saying like, "This is this is not a good idea." Yeah. You know? Yeah. Like, or at least I felt that in the beginning. Yeah. You know? it, it was never gonna be smooth. You know, it's yeah. always gonna be like, "Yo, you're not gonna like." You're gonna in- integrate the spirit world with like our world. Yeah, and it's not gonna like for both sides, you know. And she's like, yeah, like uh, the Avatar is no longer gonna be the bridge, but yeah. she kind of still has to be, you know, the bridge. If you think about it, like exactly. Yeah. Like I, I, her intentions are good, but the consequences are are like proof yeah. enough that it, like it's not working so far. It's not working, but it might work. Random people are getting urban. That is, how do you feel about that? I feel like I kind of like I don't know. I feel like it, the airbending loses its significance, but it also gains its significance as well. How does it gain it? Because there some, must be something special about airbending only when that assault, when that um, when it's only because it's happening. The harmonic thing. We don't know. We don't. We don't know if the harmonic thing is the reason. Like that's a yeah, that, that, conclusion. That's, exactly. But we don't know if that's like the reason why it's happening. Yeah, but still. Like, for my personal take on like the whole airbending is back. Um. I kind of like, I kind of like it when it was just like a, a, a few select few people who had airbending, like Tenzin and everybody. Yeah. Like, you know, like, like, cause I feel like I'm so accustomed to seeing just Aang be the only airbender. And now like, you see these random people with airbending, I'm just like, fuck, you know? Like for me, airbending was special in terms of like, I liked it when it was this stuff, but like, now you see these random people in the street to get fucking airbending, and it's just like, I, I feel like it's losing the significance of like how special it was to me personally. And that's that was the downside. Yeah, you know, I, like, like, I, I kind of like I, I liked it when it was like only a few select people could now have it with me. Like, you know, like I don't know, like maybe maybe that's just how it's supposed to be, right? Like, like you know, bending not supposed to be rare. So like, especially like the four elements, like like earth, water, and fire. Everybody has that. A lot of people have that. So yeah, you know, air is no different. So. But I feel like as a viewer, as a viewer, I'm just like, fuck, you know? <laughs> like, I, wanted, I don't want everybody to have it. Like, I don't know. That's pretty much it, honestly. Like, yeah. we, we have, uh, yeah. uh, what do we have? We have, <laughs> what's his name? Um, Mako is, like, being all weird about running girls. Uh, they yeah. love things yeah. there, but mainly, the bad guy's back, or in. <laughs> he's back. <laughs> I guess he's there, he's out of prison, so and, he's and, back. And, and Korra is struggling, and well, Korra's new objective is to find all oh, the airbenders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. around the world. Yeah, and then yes. together. That is true. Yeah. So, so we will get into that. And still don't have a box. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, so is, is this Katara and Zuko? 
Bro, yo, Zuko is, yo, Zuko hype is back and he's gonna fucking take these guys on? Yo, but even Zuko himself said these guys are strong enough to take over the world. So how did they, first of all, how did these guys get in prison? Who the fuck are these guys? Uh, I don't know. They're like, yo, it's so insane because Zuko's like, yo, like, if Zuko was like this guy, right? What happened between when Aang became, like, Stop the Fire King? And yeah, the or Lord of and, and, and all of this. Yeah, like I feel like this guy. Is There's an untold cool. story. Of course, there's gonna be some rebellions and shit. Yeah, but these four guys, what these four guys that Amy with Zuko feel? Yo, they have something to do with the White Lotus because they're so against the fucking White Lotus. They're against. They're the against the White Lotus. Yeah. Maybe maybe they didn't believe in that shit, but like, so they made their own little cult. Because remember the White Lotus? Like they made it. It was made out of like Iro, Double J. The, the Sakura Master who taught him like the sword and sword and, shit. and Bumi. Bumi. You know, so these four guys and, and Ira was like the, the, the head of that, the, the White Lotus, I think. Right. So, like, that was like a thing, right? So, are these guys a different organization that goes completely against those guys and they have like their four guys and they made me a I assume that because, because yeah, there's four against four. Yeah, and like, so this, they made their own little Lotus group just to go against like the real White Lotus because they hate, because for them, White Lotus, Avatar. You gotta get rid of these two guys. And I, I remember the White Lotus is consisting of those guys. So these guys are making their own fucking group. But like, so, they, so it's not, they're not making their group, they made a group. They, they, they got defeated, so they're all in prison, in the most deadliest prison you'll see. You know what's the most like, most prison is in the middle of lava. <laughs> right, right. Like, this, is, this, is, this is extreme measure for these people. You, you, know, you know how, I didn't know how strong that girl was. Which girl? The girl with no hands. Oh, and you need hands to, 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 to fall water. Oh, but, she just, but she just came on her and she's like, her hands became water. Just from bending. We've never seen that happen, eh? Ever. No, like, I don't think we've ever seen like somebody replace like an element part with their body with a limb or something. Yeah, yeah it's crazy. Yeah, yeah, you're right. But yeah. you need hands to control the water. That's true. That's, I, mean, I actually never realized that. That's fuck, bro. I, I, I'm sorry, man. This seeing Zuko grown up, he kind of looks like I, I'm not gonna say Sozin, or maybe uh, or he's he kind of like Iron to be honest. A bone, an older version of Iron. I roll not really. He kind of looks like Sozin and Roku, kind of from my that okay, that is his grandpa. Yeah. Both of them. But oh no, no, not both of them, but like great grandpa. I can see Roku. Yeah. But like Yeah, like sort of like Roku and Sozin. He kinda of looks like you know, for me, yo, when I saw the scar, when I saw the, I, that's the only thing I saw, and I'm just like, wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This scar look I haven't seen this in a minute, bro. Like what the fuck? It's still so cool. Sucks that Sokka's dead though. Man, yeah. bring that up. No, because like everyone's alive except except <laughs> Aang and Sokka. <laughs> Sokka, man. Oh, who was the first? Oh, yeah, yeah. But anyways, Zuko's yeah, Zuko, Zuko, uh, Zuko back. He and he's gonna he ride a fucking dragon. Yo, so did he go back and conquer a dragon, or like did the dragons come to him? Like, I mean, remember the one episode? Like, remember Iroh became dragon in the West because he like he like he didn't defeat a dragon, but like he like he basically. Um, he, I think I think I think he, he didn't want to. He, he he kept that dragon civilization low key or something. So so like I forgot what the exact details. Were. Like, I, don't, I, don't, I don't I don't know. I'm trying to brush up on my memory, but like Iro had that. So that and this Zuko ended up like he has because he, he had a fucking dragon. So this Zuko the dragon of the West or something. Shit! I don't know why I'm so hyped for Zuko. And he's gonna go fight those guys. He literally just said I'm gonna stop them. Basically, yeah, Zuko's fucking capable of fighting. Like, we know that. So the next, the fourth person. No, I don't know. I don't know who's gonna fight right now. The fourth person is of the northern water. It's like some girl, right? Yeah, because yeah. You, like, you have to, you have to like fucking tell those tribes up front to like, hey, notify them right away if you're gonna come to like free their last. Or I'm assuming that's the last one. It's some girlfriend or whatever. His name is Zahir. I got his name. And the other guy is Gazan. That guy is like Earth Fire. I don't know how the fuck he's doing that. Or, or is he spinning the earth so fast it becomes fire? I don't think so. Or is he, is he a firebender? I'm he's, not sure. No, he's an earthbender. There's a two rocks in his thing. That, that's what he started like. Yeah, he started with that. Yeah, he's, he's definitely like an earthbender. But bro, and this Zaheer guy. Is that his name Zaheer? Yeah, I got his name Zaheer. <laughs> like he never had like bending at all. But now like, like, the, like what I'm trying to say is that like, he never had bending, but he was like sort of like a leader figure for these people. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, like, we, we, can't, we can't go off anything right now. If there's four of them? Yeah. Like, I'm not sure. Because, yo, these guys are like fucking. Like, 
fucking chaos. So everywhere. all the other guys did not know about the sword, the soccer's teacher, the swordsman. He didn't have his name, I'm pretty sure. He just had the swordsman skills. Really? I believe so. I th- wasn't he like a firebender? I know he lived in the Fire Nation, but I don't know if he was a firebender. That's a good point. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure then. Maybe I could be wrong, wrong, but that's what I remember. Okay, but I know he was from Fire Nation, so... So, but, like, I don't think you have to be a bender in general to... Yeah, him. maybe he was just a leader, but then... Because that guy mentioned it, oh, it's like, you're, you're an airbender now? It's like, yeah, I found this new kind of ability that it's got. And, like, now, now they have... <clears throat> they have an airbender, waterbender, firebender... No, no, do they have a fire? They don't have a firebender, though. Do they? They have air, water, earth, and this girl, but, like... But she's in the northern, maybe, I don't know what they're doing there. Was she being in prison there? She's probably a firebender. I'm assuming. I'm assuming. So maybe they kept fire. Oh, I think it makes sense. Maybe they're, they're putting all these all these people in prison in, in areas where it's, where it's not, like, suited for, like, firemen. Like, that would make sense. You know, I think that makes sense, right? Because yeah, that, that girl's water. That girl's water. She's, water. she's like, not lava, right? Yeah. So there's no water at all. So they, okay, I think, I think they did it that way. So they put her in, like, the northern tribe because there's, like, water and fucking cold and shit. It doesn't suit that fire element, right? So I think, I think that's what they're doing here. Which is fucking smart, actually. Right. That detail is actually fucking smart. I actually enjoy that a lot. But, bro, I am, bro, I, I think so far, I've been, I've never been this hyped for the villains. As, yeah, as, yeah. as much as I am in for this book. So 100%. Like, 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 I'll, already, like, when the locks, like, thing, like, this is much better than that in terms of, like, this being the main bad guy. And the, and the, I just like, hate it. Why did that one bring it up? You know, like, Amon was sick, though. Amon was sick. Like, I like this. Like, Unala was kind of more straightforward, like, oh, you know, this and that. But, like, these guys seem like an like actual threat, a story. The fucking White Lotus is involved somehow. Like, I don't know what's happening, bro, but I'm like, I'm getting super stinking about it. I'm getting so hyped right now. Because, yo, these guys really fucked up the world, bro. They literally fucked up the world. They're so cool, so I don't want to fight these guys. But who imprisoned them? Probably Zuko and everybody. Zuko seems to be in charge and he knows how terrifying these people could be. Bro. Bro, I'm actually getting so hyped right now. And it wasn't that, what else happened? <laughs> We're just hyping up these guys. I, I, bro, I, that's all I can think about, man. Um, yo, so they got this. So they went to they're heading to Ba Sing Se. So what the, they went to Ba Sing Se first. I don't know. Was that Ba Sing Se or they're gonna head there right now? Uh, I'm not sure. Good question. Because sure. they said they're gonna head to Ba Sing Se and then the yeah, they met the first guy who was the airbender, but he's like, "Yo, okay, what do you think? What are, you, what are your thoughts on this?" They're the, I I agree with the people. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> and like, like I met some guy yeah. came to me. He's like, "Yo, yo, yo you, you need to ditch your life." And, Practice the old ways of there. I'm like, yo, get the fuck out of my house. Okay? Like, I'm brushing teeth too. Like, yeah, fuck off. Like, yeah, I'm being serious, man. Like, if somebody came to me, even if I found this airman, like, like that, like that annoying 22 year old kid was like, he's like, oh, I, I don't want it. You know, this came to me. Like, 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 I don't blame the people for, like, he's like, yo, I have a house, I have a family, I have, like, things happening for me. It's like, why would I, like, like, why the fuck would well, I let everything go? Yeah, but let me show you. Yeah, I, I get like, that. It doesn't matter, like, you know? Like, well, I, I understand that, and that's why I agree with them. But yeah. I also disagree with them in the sense that, like, you just have a newfound ability that's beyond your expectations. Yeah. You have a new responsibility at the same time. Yeah, but, like, it's about the understanding and responsibility, right? Like, look, because we're these, these guys are common like, folk. Yeah, exactly. We're common, we're folk. common folk, too. Yeah, yeah exactly. If, if, like, Again, like, I'm not, we can't really compare it to our world, but, like, if I had, like, say, a newfound thing where everybody, somebody randomly comes to start enforcing their responsibility upon me, like, my first reaction would be, like, uh, sorry, like, like, no, you know? <laughs> <laughs> sorry? No. Uh, no, <laughs> like, I, like, I am my life, right? I'm not, I'm not gonna, like, okay, cool, like, I didn't ask for this, so, especially if you have a family, kids and shit, like, I'm not gonna fucking, like, exactly, like, you know, like, but at the same time, it's just, like, I, it's a big thing. It's a fucking new civilization that it was extinct and they're coming back. So like, so there has to be somebody to guide them. So that in itself is like a big thing. But exactly. But like, you know, what? I can't help but think that if I put myself in this situation, I'd be like, I don't really care. You know, like, I don't know, man. I feel like I like. <laughs> you know, the boy who's selling it. He's like, you don't have to worry about other like worldly desires or things because you won't have any. <laughs> 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 All those friends, this, this piece of shit in front of me in this door. Oh my god, but, but yeah, I, I don't know, man. This seems com- very complicated. And that's, that's why you're gonna get the odd fish to join them, like this kid. Like, those are Kai? Yeah, Kai will just find a way, a new life or some shit. 
You know, Kai pisses me off. I'm still mad at him. Well, I don't blame him. I think the orphan trying to make trying to like steal, trying to you know, like yeah, we got adopted to a family. But I love him when 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 um, Mako's like yo, I got I got my eyes on you. Yeah, exactly. I'm yeah. so happy that Mako actually you know come and join in. If he stayed behind, I actually would have been pissed off with the orphan. Oh yeah, he'd be. I like I love how Mako's trying to be so professional with Korra. Like yes, Avatar. Like mm, he's just being weird and shit. You can't. You can't. I, I don't blame him. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I don't blame him. No, of course I'm, I'm like so, you know, like some, sometimes like sometimes the best way is just like try to treat this person whatever you yeah, have you have a history with. Jim, let's just be professional. Yeah, professional, be respectful. Be, yeah, just be professional and pretend like nothing happened. You know. <sighs> he's trying to do that, but he's, he's failing at it. But yeah, I'm just saying. I, I'm just saying. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so they got Kai, this kid, who tends and was like, oh, fuck no. Who get on the pressure. All right. No one attends like, hey, I want this kid in my fucking, in my fucking boat, bro. But, that now you know, it's like, oh, shit, this kid's gonna try to, yeah, get the fuck away from my daughter. <laughs> you know, this problem is everybody. You get everybody this fight. <laughs> oh my god, but. That's, uh, that's, that's the thing. But, yeah. you know what, at least they got a recruit. And I'm so fucking excited for her. I'm just, I'm just not thinking about Zuko, I don't have a cheap one. Like, yeah, see, I don't want to talk about anything else, <laughs> Zuko's back. Bro, Zuko's back. Man, I remember how many the fucking love Zuko in the Avatar. Remember those days? Season, uh, book three, remember book three? Fuck, book three was redemption, bro, redemption. I might just, like, in my own time, just rewatch book three by itself. Bro, book three was special, man. Like, I, the whole show was special, bro. Like, yeah. book one, like, I, like, because Zuko is like my favorite character, obviously, right? Oh, I'm and just seeing him back as an old man, but like, with responsibility, and he's like, he's like, we must protect the avatar. It's just so surreal to see this, you know? Just, you know, after, after the whole, like, Zuko here, you know? Right. Uncle, uncle, uncle. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite shit. Oh, yeah. man, I'm getting all. Oh, I remember I remember Zuko's journey. Okay, anyways, we're going on tangent here, but stay tuned for the next episode. Yeah, it's gonna be your MVP of today. And who's gonna be the fuck? <laughs> well, I don't know why my voice is crap. Um, MVP? Ah, oh, shit, we can go with to the. Uh, fuck, man, it's like Zahir. It has to be Zahir, bro. Zahir started the trend, man. He started the trend, and he, he's like, bro, mm-hmm. the, way, the way he's like so tactically, like, throw rocks in there, boom. <laughs> Put a bucket of water, boom. Efficient, man. That group is doing work, and they're doing it so efficiently, and like, the fact that they could like destroy the world, that's fucking like something else, man. That's true. That's something else, bro. And like, and you know, it's just I, I don't know what else to say, man. Like these these guys are like they're they're they're, they're escaping like there's nothing. Also, shout out to the coach because all the shout out to him, bro. <laughs> He's always the MVP in our hearts. <laughs> but yeah, 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 I, yeah, I, yeah. I, think, I think this clear cut, man. As you say here, like this, you can't get any more clear than this. So here's gonna be the MVP of today. You made us believe. Put clothes on our backs. You sacrifice for us. You the real MVP. All right, guys, give me the flop. Everybody do the flop. Flop. All right. Fuck. Okay, who's gonna be the flop for this episode? What do you um, think? Those guards. Oh, those we can just keep giving the fucking guards. We gotta choose one person, man. Yeah, but like, getting more creative. All right. Okay. Um. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Wait. Okay. Who who are you thinking? Like the guy who who lives in the mom's basement. <laughs> <laughs> well technically, that is pretty flop worthy. You, you saw the way he was like with Cora. That's like, not oh. that's not flop worthy. Don't don't call me that flop worthy. <laughs> <laughs> but, but like I mean like the way he was like, oh I don't know. Oh no 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 problem. I don't care. Sure. <laughs> like the way he was just pissing Cora. So I was like I'm not having this. <laughs> Yo, shit. <laughs> like, like, yeah, I'm gonna give him a flop, bro. Yeah, I'm giving this guy the flop, bro. Just, just, just cause, just because. You know, even if we give him the flop, he's probably gonna be like, I don't care. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> whatever. Fuck you, you, know, you know, you're the flop, this is important. He's like, no, no, okay. 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 But but you're the flop in our show, like, that's fucking disaster. No, 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 fuck, fuck you, no, fuck you, fuck you. Can I get out of my house? <laughs> fuck you, you know, you're the flop in this episode. <laughs> Alright, guys, that's it for today. We just watched two episodes. Uh, let's see how much we can get down. The exciting stuff, the super good is this for real, bro? I'm not dreaming about this, man. So you guys stay tuned for that. My dreams? No. So stay tuned for the next episode. Not my dreams. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> and do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Alistair Reiser is pizza. Out.